Okay, can we do even, even, even better? Even better than that? Sure, how about if I'm really generous? This is non-alcoholic, and I'm gonna give you the fat in grams, the carbohydrate in grams, and the protein in grams of our secret ingredient. Does anyone wanna spoil the punchline for us? Who knows about nutrition? Let's have it. Nine, four, and four, the magic numbers. Because we as humanity have figured out a whole lot about nutrition, and we already know the answer. Well, it doesn't matter if we know the answer, why don't we see if we can recover that same answer from this data set with machine learning. Uh, but yeah, let's hope that our final answer is gonna look something like that answer. So here we go. This thing is now not a plane anymore. It's now a hyperplane, so let's go ahead and plot it. <laughs> let's not. There's no real reason to be plotting it here because at the end of the day, the way that we check how well we're doing, how we get that score that we're optimizing, it happens the same way no matter what is in here. All we need to know about is that we take what's predicted, we compare it with the truth, and we see how we did. And inside this thing, however beastly it is, there are some numbers that we are allowed to tinker with, and we'll use an optimization algorithm to do the tinkering for us, and hopefully some researcher somewhere has written that optimization code so we don't have to. So that's a much better thing to spend your time on if you're in a research division or research in industry or research division in academia. Good, and they have, and so we don't have to worry about it. All we need to know is four things to tinker with. We'll still assess the results the same way. Doesn't matter what's there. So let's get on with it and use that optimization algorithm, which we don't need to know how it works. And there you go. How did we do? Nine, four, four, something like that. Looks pretty good to me. Uh, FDA, by the way, confirms what you say. This is a quote from their website. Carbohydrate provides four calories per gram, protein four, and fat nine. So uh, very good general knowledge. What on earth is this 143 thing? Well, we ask ourselves, if there is no fat, no carbs, and no protein, if our secret ingredient was water, What's left? Well, there was yogurt in there every time. Now, it turns out our yogurt base had 145 calories. We're predicting 143 as a little bit of a mismatch. So maybe there was some error in our data. But you know what? Our score is getting pretty good. Not perfect, but pretty good. We're off by four calories on average when it used to be 47. And this is, again, a shout out to feature engineering. The fact that you had the knowledge about this domain and realized that having the weights in grams of all of these things was going to be useful, that is the reason that you get a model that's this good in the end. It pays off. You can convert your domain knowledge into good solutions. And how did we do in the end? Our underestimate for quiche Lorraine is only four calories. I say good enough, let's drink it.